Michael asks, as a huge fan and student teacher, I'd like to know what you feel makes a great teacher. I think what makes a great teacher is one that doesn't impose what they want the student to learn, but the person that actually audits the student and understands where to point them. A counterpuncher, for say, more so than somebody who's got a strict blueprint and whether or not you fit into that blueprint is irrelevant. I, teacher Rick, am going to make you go down this path and this is what you have to learn and I think it's a huge mistake. It's my biggest problem with curriculum in traditional schooling. It does not account for the creative, the over smart, the slightly different and what it's trying to do is create an 80% of these type of output workers. Um, and the 20% either pro or con get kind of left along the way. And so I think a great teacher listens and a great teacher reacts and a great teacher deploys empathy and understands there's other things, can sniff out there's problems at home if you're in the younger years or as an older, I feel like I'm a teacher and I, I feel like one of the biggest things I try to say all the time is I'm just telling you what works for me. Please don't do, I don't tell you you have to work 18 hours a day. I don't tell you you have to do anything. I tell you that this is what works. These are some theories and use the context around that. I think teachers need a lot more listening skills and adjustment to the reality versus how they were, how they were taught or what they're trying to accomplish by year's end. By year's end, these 23 students are gonna know how to do multiplication. Like, it's so tactical, it doesn't feel like a teacher at all. And I, and I question and I push and I prod and I poke and I, I, I battle a lot of my teaching friends of, are you just checking the box for your eight months a year job to like get it through, to hit tenure, to be in a union that never creates any vulnerability? Or are you trying to actually teach these kids? And I hope everybody understands, I'm, I'm not pumped I'm not cynical against teachers. I don't think teachers, I don't, I, like, I, I think a lot of times, sometimes people when they hear micro answers from me, think like I'm tough on teachers or this and that nature. I'm mad at the game. I wish teachers would got paid $400,000 a year. I would, I, I mean, I send my kids to private school. I spend a lot of money. Like, teachers, like, I don't like the system that a lot of people K through 12 have to play within and I think a lot of those talented teachers could be doing unbelievable things and I'm so excited, show the computer. I'm so excited, actually not that computer by the time it actually happens. I'm so excited, actually it's probably gonna be contact lenses. I'm so excited for this because so many of the great teachers in the world won't have to play within the confines of the politics of the traditional school system and will teach, be way more profitable and make much bigger, and this is the big one, make a much bigger impact on their students' lives.